Halloween is coming up very soon, but before you buy that costume, a heads up, experts are warning about toxins in some costumes, candy, and even those trick-or-treat bags. Now, today I spoke to an environmental toxin expert about what these high vinyl products can do to our bodies, our kids' bodies, and why they're dangerous. Can you tell me again what some of the symptoms could be of too much vinyl exposure? Sure. Um, anything like that with phthalates. Phthalates is one of the concerns that is contained in vinyl. Another thing, again, is cadmium and lead. It can be contaminated with. And um, endocrine disruption, which is hormone disruption, is the simpler way to say it. And again, when you interrupt your body's important processes, um, because hormones are our chemical messengers. So anything that comes into the body and blocks or mimics or over or underproduces can cause a problem anywhere in our body, whether it's with our brain and nervous system, or it could even lead to obesity, lower IQ, cancer, autoimmune, so many different things. And when our body systems are developing as children, we definitely don't want to get in there and have anything that's going to disrupt those important processes. Harris says your best bet this Halloween is to avoid heavy metal in face point, so go for non-toxic instead. Avoid costumes made with flame retardant chemicals like vinyl masks, especially anything with PVC, and avoid that candy with artificial coloring.